former Idaho State football players and coaches returned to Pocatello for the annual Idaho State football alumni team golf scramble this past Saturday at Highland Golf Course. All proceeds from the event went toward funding a fat endowed football scholarship at Idaho State. This is really a, a great reunion. You know, our uh, football al alumni team's purpose is to, uh, you know, attract people back to the university and to make them feel welcome and uh, to promote and support uh, ISU football. And so when we see people you know, coming back, and most of these people are alumni, and uh, it's very important. It's very important to me, to the FAT group, and to Idaho State University. Idaho State football alumni kicked off the weekend with a meet and greet Friday evening at Phil Meter Toyota, where former players, coaches, and their families could catch up and relax before teeing up for the golf scramble on Saturday. Current Tampa Bay Buccaneers head coach and ISU football alum Dirk Cutter was in attendance, as well as current ESPN analyst and ISU football alum Merrill Hodge. Yeah, it's awesome. I, I always love to come back to Pocatello. Of course, it's my hometown. My folks live here. Great to see so many familiar faces and uh, ex-teammates. So, yeah, I enjoy coming back always and to help Idaho State. Well, listen, I think that is always vital if you're going to really build things and be special at anything. You have to have people that are going to be invested in it for a long time. They want to come back and they want to support it. So it's a great turnout. So it's a, it's a good start. Cutter, Hodge, and the rest of the football alumni spanning decades arrived at Highland Golf Course on Saturday for the golf scramble. The event featured several four-person teams with two blind draws at 8 a.m. and 1.30 p.m., as well as food, drink, and endless entertainment with 18 holes of golf. Well, I took a year off, so, and even before that, I'm not saying, I'm not going pro yet, but I'm working on going pro, but I got a lot of work to do. 